What we are doing of blessing before the Lord? What is malignant in our mind? What is malignant in my heart? Mm. What is causing the unhappiness in my life? Mm. Because sometimes, probably it could be, I don't know, so looks good, with good clothes and having food, but I don't feel happy. Mm. And why I don't feel happy? Because one of the fruit of the Holy Spirit is gladness. And if I get baptized, in a, if I am happy, if I receive the Holy Spirit, why I'm not happy? Even if I have trials. So something is because probably I have something in my mind that I never confessed before the Lord. But the Lord say, today is the day of good news. Today is the good of yes. today is the day of salvation. Yes. You just need to go to me and say, Jesus Christ, this is my sin. Oh, I don't know what is I, I don't remember what is my sin. But help me, Holy Spirit, guide me and show me my sin. That I can repent of my sin yes. and I can be just like white as snow. Yes. And I can be happy and I can receive the fruit of the Holy Spirit. Yes. So, also, and I think that wickedness is misery. So, do you remember the, what well, now we are in South School? So, Jeremiah is a good book. But it's a book of difficult things that we are learning. They were living in misery. Mm -hmm. Even if they were king or something like this, but they were living in, in misery. Yes. But God said to them, even God warned them a lot, too much times, but God, God said to them also, today the Lord says that have a future of hope and peace for you. Mm. But yes. what was the, what, what they should do? So they should go to, to the Lord and repent of the evil things that they were doing. Just like Nineveh was doing. Mm -hmm. Nineveh repented. Israel, sometimes, or other times not, so, but today. Mm -hmm. So this is the history. And today, we, our personal life, are we living just like uh, the Nineveh? Are we ready to repent just like Nineveh do it? Are we, what, we want to continue just like Israel was doing in Jeremiah's mm -hmm. time? So it's our decision. It's a personal decision. Mm -hmm. We can pray for you. You can pray for me. Mm -hmm. But I choose what I want. God mm -hmm. chooses us through Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. But we then decide if we want or if we don't want. Mm -hmm. So now, coming back again to wickedness. One of the other meaning is displeasant. So displeasant is... What is the displeasant before the Lord? So the displacement before the Lord is because the, the <clears throat> because it's something that doesn't match. So you know, when, when something is displacing before the Lord, it's because we have a sin. And when we have a sin, and here is God, so sin and God, they don't match each other. Mm -hmm. So we need something that guide me to God. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. So because the sin that is in me, doesn't match with God. So just like imagine God is here and here. So I go to boom, boom, just like repel. But I need something, or I need Jesus Christ, and I go to Jesus Christ, and through Jesus Christ, now I confess my sin, and God look at Jesus Christ and said, okay, for the love that I have for Jesus Christ, so I can forgive your sins. I can forgive the sins of the heart of the church. And then, from this pleasant, from wickedness, now we, we want to be holy. Because God called us to be holy through Jesus Christ. Because Jesus Christ, when prayed for us, says, Father, that they be holy as you are holy. Yes. 